I think for women around this country, what, what, what they were sensing was that after decades of, of believing that the issue of contraception and, and women's access to contraception, that we had resolved that decades ago. Now, all of a sudden, this is, this is not only discussion in Congress, but you've got presidential wannabes that are talking about whether or not contraception is good, bad, indifferent, wrong. I, I think what, what you, you, you're sensing is, is a fear, a concern, that women feel threatened that a long settled issue might not be so settled. When I came back home and made the comments that I made to, to an Anchorage reporter about how I regretted the, the, the vote on the Blunt Amendment, it was in direct reflection to where we were, where we are, I think, as a nation, in women feeling that the party that I have chosen to affiliate myself with, the Republican Party, is ignoring their concerns, is, 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 is causing them to feel like the rights that they uh, believe were settled a long time ago are now uh, being threatened, possibly eroded. Let me ask you this from, a, from just a, a strategic and tactical uh, uh, side of thinking. Of, are, are the Republicans make maybe stepping into a, a trap and I mean do they really what I guess the question I'm trying to ask is what are they thinking of alienating <laughs> so many women I asked the same question to my colleagues I said it it, it 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 makes no sense to go down this road it makes no sense to attack women and if you don't view this as an attack on a women on women then you need to go home and you need to talk to your wives you need to go talk to your daughters ask them if they feel that this is an attack, because this is how women are perceiving the situation.